Hey, good evening, guys. This is Baka Pachin Sholikar. Welcome back to Test Automation Tool Selenium. This is the third tutorial on Test TestNG Framework Annotations for the Selenium Web Driver or Selenium Automation Testing. Let us jump to the high level agenda for the today's video tutorial. These are all the different types of annotations. We have discussed a few in this list. We have discussed annotation test with the different parameters. And also we have discussed before method and after method. In this video tutorial, we will discuss before, sorry, annotation before class and annotation after class. And after that, we will discuss annotation before test and annotation after test. Finally, we will be discussing before suit and the after suit. Let us jump to the Eclipse ID. This is the program we left in the previous video tutorial. So let me comment this uh, particular test method. So here I am writing uh, before. First we will discuss before class annotations. So here I am here I'm writing just class and just to import the related packages here. You have to select the test engine annotations. That's all. This before class annotation that name itself tells you that it will execute before class. So this particular statements whatever the statements you have written under this annotation before class in this un particular Facebook login login method here it will execute before after loading this particular annotations class it will execute first this particular method then after that it will go and execute this second test method sorry first test method and the second test method that's all the program out output will be first it will print the facebook login successfully and it will print the search text box form and after that it will print you the search text one box form let us execute this program That's all. See here, you can see the output properly. First, it is executing the Facebook login method, and then it is executing another two methods that is, search box and the search box one method. That's all. Let me uh, write one more method. Just I'll uh, modify to this uh, after method only. Just remove the comments here. Here I am writing the class here. Just import the related uh, packages. That's all. This method after class, this particular test method, whatever you have written under the Facebook logout method, it will be executed whatever the statements. In my case, there is no so many statements. In my case, only one statements are there. So it will be executed this particular system dot out dot print ln statement will be executed after executing all the test that is a search box one and the search box two. If you have more test methods after executing all those method at the end it will execute this particular after class method. That's all. The output of this program will be first it will execute this particular method because I have specified this method as a before annotation and then it will execute this method search box and after that it will execute this search box one method. Then finally it will execute Facebook logout method. Let us run this program and you will be seeing the output clearly and you will uh, understand very clearly. Let us move to the console tab here. First it is executing the Facebook login successfully and after that it is executing first method and the second method. Finally it is logging out from the Facebook. That is all for the before class and the after class annotations. Uh, the next annotation is before test and after test for showing the usage of that particular 
annotation before test and the annotation after test and you, I need to run the two Java programs. For that reason, I will create a, another package here. So for that, I need to, if I need to run now two Java programs, I need to create the XML file. For that reason, I am creating a simple package. That's it. Here you select the package here. And here you give the package name. That's all. Click on finish button. Just you copy and just I'm copying the this program and I'm pasting it this program into the test engine annotations. Just I'll open this, I'll just I'll close this uh, program from the another package. I'll open this particular program that is annotation. Let me copy the same program and I'll paste it under the same. This class name is test uh, sorry annotations to click on finish button in annotation sorry in annotations just I'll make a uh, minor changes in the annotations to class here I'll delete the this to before class and the after class method that's all for if if we want to see the output statements differently so we can differentiate the output statements if i write if i modify these statements in the annotation annotation sorry annotations to java class so here just i'm uh, uh, entering to to the this particular system dot out dot print line statement under the annotations to and after that just i'll enter to that's it. In my annotations to class, I have two methods. That is print. Uh, that is printing on me, starting with the two, and another method I have that is also printing me the one statement starting with the two. So we can differentiate in the output. Go to the annotations here. Let me write the annotation test here. Just I'll rename this with the test that's all just import the related packages to that uh, before test now I'll explain you the what exactly this before test will do and the after test will do here I'm just I'll convert this package to the XML file, just right click on that particular package and go to the test engine and convert to the test engine. That's all. Here it is giving the XML file name as test engine.xml. Just click on finish button. Just you open this, here you got this particular uh, test engine.xml. Open that particular file. Here you will be seeing two Java classes. The first one is annotations, that is this one. And another one is annotations two. That is this one. So here in annotations, I have defined before test. Before test, it in it executes after loading this particular two classes, and after that, this after test method whatever you have written under this facebook logout it will execute after executing all the test methods from these two classes that is the annotations and the annotations to class that's all just you run this uh, test engine.xml sorry just go to the run uh, run as and execute test engine suit I think you have got the output here. Just let me drag it here. Yeah, here you got the output. See here, it is executing Facebook login successfully. That is 
after loading this particular annotation and annotation 2 it is executing that is very first method called facebook login that we have mentioned as annotation before test so it is executing first that is uh, expected behavior after that it is executing this search text box from the annotations one that is a uh, this method and after that it is executing another method from the annotations that is search text one box font and after that it is going to the annotations two and after that it is executing this another two methods from the test uh, sorry annotations two class and finally it is execute finally it is going back to the annotations i have mentioned one me one method called facebook logout with the after test so finally it is executing this facebook logout successfully see here i am getting the same statement from the after test method that's all for the annotation before test and the after test and we will discuss one more annotation called let me drag it here that is uh, before suit and the after suit let me write uh, here as uh, some this will copy this methods this will paste it here this will be my before suit just me uh, just i'm writing it just i'll give a minute i'll explain it what exactly this will do before suit and after suit import the related packages that's all in a method also i'll make a little changes here started suit that's all in the output statement also i'll make uh, little changes here started started suit i'll print here ended suit that's all this before test you'll be using when you are any preconditions for executing all the test for in the this particular class or the particular entire suit that's all say for example uh, you are launching the web browser and you are entering the login credential for that uh, in your web application so such kind of activities you can perform it under the before suit suppose say in after suit it will execute after executing all the test all the tests and all the methods from the particular this test engine xml so it will you can for say for example if if you want to close the, all the browsers you have opened by using this particular test suit and if you want to close all the files in such a time you can write it under the this particular after suit methods that's all this will be executed first in this particular testrange.xml suit and this ended suit will be executed at the end of this suit execution just you run this dot sorry testrange.xml just click on test suits and here you will be seeing the output of this program so started suit and after that it is executing that is a before test and after that it is executing all the methods from the annotation and after that it is executing two methods from the this uh, annotation two class and finally it is executing that is which we have mentioned the after test method from from the 
after test method from the annotations class that is after test it is executing facebook logout successfully and after that it is executing the this after suit method that's all i have in this video tutorial and we have discussed these three that is annotation before class and up annotation after class and we have discussed annotation before before test and after that we have discussed annotation after test and finally we have discussed this annotation before suit and the annotation after suit in the next video tutorial we will talk about annotation before group and annotation after group and annotation data provider you will be seeing in the upcoming video tutorial if you have any queries you can comment in the comment section or else you can drop me an email to the my email gmail id and also you can uh, send me the queries if you faced any difficulties uh, while using these uh, annotations please do subscribe like and share this video and thanks for watching